Rated M for Mature. On this episode of Tips and Tricks presented by Xfinity, we break down some of Call of Duty World War II's weapons and the best way to use them. First, let's take a look at the STG-44, an automatic rifle with modest damage and low recoil. While it may not be the most powerful of the assault rifles, its incredibly high fire rate makes it a very versatile weapon. The two attachments that are best to use with the STG-44 are Quick Draw and Grip. Quick Draw will allow you to aim down the sights faster, and using Grip will turn a relatively low recoil weapon into an assault rifle with laser-like precision. Let's take a look at a dominant submachine gun in Call of Duty World War II. The MP40 will be available once you reach Airborne Prestige 1. If you're an SMG player, it's highly recommended that you work on leveling your Airborne Division early to unlock this incredible weapon. The reason the MP40 is one of the best guns in the game is simply due to balance. This automatic SMG doesn't particularly excel in damage, range, accuracy, or fire rate. However, it doesn't feature any significant weaknesses. What that creates is a phenomenally balanced submachine gun. Do you like to run and gun? A combination of steady aim and rapid fire is deadly. You should do your best to avoid long-range gunfights, but the increased accuracy from grip and the improved damage fall-off range from advanced rifling will increase your chances. The STG-44 and MP-40 are just two of the many weapons available to you in Call of Duty World War II. Try them all and see what best fits your playstyle. In the coming videos, we will provide tips on map positioning and all new score streaks that will help you dominate the competition. Make sure to check out the gaming section on Xfinity X1 for more tips and tricks over the next few weeks. We'll see you online.